Welcome guys to this new channel. My name is Raphael. Hi, my name is Julie. And together we'll try to reach a professional level in paddle. Yeah. I can hear the demons call when they do what they do. And now I feel like taking off, find a place with the view. The pain is never gonna stop if it's controlling you. I know the time can heal it all. I just gotta get through. I just gotta get through. I just gotta get through. Cause I feel like taking off, find a place with the view. The pain is never gonna stop if it's controlling you. played 20 times something like that so really not that much uh, but I think we can learn really fast and to learn fast we need also to take classes so we are heading to our first class so that's why we moved in Spain we are currently in Spain and looking for something to rent so we can train more We just arrived, so we are currently in Belregard. It's in the southeast of Spain, and we are going to do our first lesson. Let's go. Okay, let's go with this first training so to coach us today we had Vicente so he's been playing for 22 years he knows a lot of uh, things about paddle and uh, he made us start with an exercise that was to warm up it's not this one I didn't film it but it was really simple we were at the net and we were trying to play uh, on our feet so really gentle it was to feel the ball after that we switch on another exercise we had julie uh, at the back of the court so she was doing uh, defense and I was at the net, so attacking. He was sending one ball to her that she had to send back to me close to the net, so to play it low. And the next one she was trying to do a lob. And at the same time, I was working on my volley. Then we switched and the main tip that I get from this is that when you uh, are at the defense, you have to play really slow. So you have more time to go back to position. And when you are at the volley, your goal is to uh, be faster. After that, we switched on another exercise and it was to work on the volley. So to work on the volley, the main tip was to play uh, cross. So we had to play on the opposite corner and he was expecting us to put the ball really low so it doesn't bounce after it hit the glasses. This was a big change for me because when I was playing it, I wasn't thinking about it a lot. So he told us that the main aim of the volley was to play cross and really low. So when I did it after that, uh, I saw that it was really hard to get it back when you are uh, in defense. And another simple thing on the volley is that you have to step uh, when you do the volley, you always have to attack it if you have time. If you don't have time, you just block it so you don't move. You keep your arm at your level and you just block it. 
and if you have more time if the ball is more slow you can attack it by stepping at the same time as you hit the ball Of course, there's many other things to correct, but uh, Vicente was really cool not saying too much for the first uh, lesson, so he let us play. He just corrected the biggest mistake and told us what we should be doing or where we should be aiming for, but he let us play and let us do mistakes without correcting like uh, every two seconds. So we played a lot of ball, we, we did a lot of mistakes, but that's part of learning. And it was really fun and really nice for a first lesson. Alright guys, time to eat. So we are gonna eat like a lot of uh, Spanish food because we were in Asia before this and we've been eating um, Asian food for now like let's say two years and some some of these were missing like uh, queso, so cheese. We've been missing cheese a lot in, in Asia. Uh, so this is like sem called semicorado. Really good. And lomo. So it's like a lot of mm, processed meat. So we're gonna eat less lomo and jamon and everything like that in the next days because we're gonna cook more um, food like chicken, beef and everything. But for now, we just miss the taste of it. So we're gonna enjoy it uh, and uh, then go work a bit, go to the go to the swimming pool for the legs, relax a bit, work, and we're gonna see if we can play our first match this afternoon so let's see what happens i know you told your friend you're not okay and tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way and guess you're trying to stay strong and fake a smile until i look away but i've known you too long it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to gray as you fade away and good morning boys let's get started for this new day it's 7 30 and uh, i'm reviewing the videos from yesterday and editing a bit so i'm gonna eat my breakfast we have there four eggs and here oatmeal plus some peanut butter and here i have uh, coffee with uh, some cereals inside so we are going to pack up some carbohydrates in the muscles to be able to train again today for uh, this new paddle lesson we have it at 10 so we have about two hours to work and then we'll go to the training
the second lesson, it was really good. We worked on some bandeja finally. So the first day was just hitting the ball from the defense and uh, learning attack. And now we did some bandejas. We did uh, some good exercises for like 25 minutes, something like that. And now we are done with the class and I think we're gonna we're gonna do some more balls. <laughs> for me, because I think you're better than me. Like it was really hard for me to to understand just how to do it. So yeah, I think uh, I have to practice a lot. Let's go. Let's go. Dinner is served. We are going to eat as a starter uh, cabbage. As a second starter, we have uh, gazpachos. As the main dish, we have Spanish wagyu with uh, cheese from the Pyrenees in France. And for the dessert, we have Spanish melon. So it's gonna be really good. Subscribe to the channel because tomorrow we're gonna play our first match. So it was really cool. Thank you for watching. See you guys later.